class. Today we are going to do a math test. Miss, why do we have to do this? I'm not going to use maths when I grow up. Must be here, young man. Every time somebody says that they won't use maths when they grow up, a genius loses points off their IQ. Very devastating stuff. Uh, who are you and what are you doing here? I, my dear boy, am Albert Einstein, a world-famous mathematician and physicist. And I'm here to show you how useful and important maths is, and pretty much prove to you that maths is our future. <laughs> so to do that, we're going to take a trip to the future. How are we going to the future? Well, being a physicist and mathematician does have its uses. I've used a series of complex algorithms and combined a few theories and tried to create time travel. Tried? Uh, yes, try. It may have a few glitches, so I'm just going to use my power as your boss fan. Let's go! Calculating energy and reactions, adding quantities of reactants to reach a desired product, using complex mathematical formulas to unlock DNA sequences, and reading data collected from our investigations. You see, we rely very heavily on maths to do our job. Oh, that's pretty cool. Well, would you look at the time? We really must be off to our next appointment. Okay, it was nice meeting you. Oh well, where are we now? We have an appointment with a doctor. Hello, I'm a doctor. How can I help you today? Well, I'm not sick. I just have a question. How do you find math useful in your job? I use math in, in my everyday job. I use it to measure out or prescribe the right dosages of medicine to patients. I, read, I use maths to read graphs and charts. I also read monitors with lots of numbers, such as blood pressure machines and heart rate monitors. See, maths is definitely important in the future. Ah, uh, yes it is. It helps us save lives every day. Like, come on, we cured cancer because of maths. Oh, wow, you did? Yes, didn't you see it on the morning robot news? <coughs> well, thanks, Doc, but we really must be on our way. Wow, well, we're the computer lab. Yes, programmers use maths all the time. You are obviously unaware of how much maths is involved in creating the software that we use on computers. Hello, I'm a programmer and we use standard addition, subtraction, multiplication and division in almost every program. Can you please tell the boy how computers are helping people? Oh, we are greatly helping people. We are currently working with engineers to create a suitable design that will allow us to build floating islands to help combat the loss of land due to rising sea levels. Wow, that sounds bad. Yes, because the polar ice caps are melting quite rapidly now. We are losing a lot of the islands and major land from all the coastlines around the world. Due to this, we have a lot of people without homes. So we are developing software that will help us to simulate the floating island designs and we can practice how they will work before we build them much more safely and cost effectively. Wow, I can really see how maths is our future. And I think I want to become a computer programmer when I grow up. Wonderful! Then my job here is done! Okay class, the mass test starts now. 